or this laudable initiative, which has contributed immensely towards reshaping the global economic landscape through infrastructure development programs. Since its establishment in 2013, the BRI, which can be said to be the largest development undertaking in the world, has made giant strides in achieving groundbreaking contributions to all economic growth and development, especially in areas of infrastructure and people-to-people -people exchanges. Hence this year's theme, high quality bail and road cooperation together for common development and prosperity could not have been more apt. These achievements are reflective of China's commitment to leveraging on the principles of cooperation and joint efforts towards achieving economic development for the common prosperity of developing economies. I also wish to note that BRI has been a major contributor to the implementation of the UN 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Growth. The digital economy has played an important role in accelerating global economic growth and recovery, as well as emplacement of mechanisms to ease the process of engaging in transborder trade and e-commerce, amongst many other advantages. I would therefore like to commend China for introducing the digital Silk Road as a vehicle for achieving international economic cooperation beyond geographical borders. Being a trading partner to most BRI member countries in varying degrees, I would like to seize this opportunity to assure you of Nigeria's readiness to collaborate with the group and other emerging markets to bring about a positive shift in the growth and development of global economies for the overall achievement of long-term economic policies in order to attain greater cooperation within the global south.